Mom is an inherently loosely coupled, asynchronous technology. This means the sender and receiver of a message are not tightly coupled, unlike synchronous middleware technologies such as Kolba. Synchronous middleware technologies have many strengths, but can lead to fragile designs if all of the components and network links always have to be working at the same time for the whole system to successfully operate. A messaging infrastructure decouples senders and receivers using an intermediate message queue. The sender can send a message to a receiver and know that it will be eventually delivered. Even if the network link is down or the receiver is not available, the sender just tells the mom technology to deliver the message and then continues on with its work. Senders are unaware of which application the process eventually processes the request depicts this basic send-receive mechanism. MOM is often implemented as a server that can handle messages from multiple concurrent clients.3 in order to decouple senders and receivers. The MOM provides message queues that senders place messages on and receivers remove messages from. A MOM server can create and manage multiple messages queues, and can handle multiple messages being sent from queues simultaneously using threads organized in a thread pool. One or more processes can send messages to a message queue, and each queue can have one or many receivers. Each queue has a name which senders and receivers specify when they perform send and receive operations. This architecture is illustrated in A MOM server has a number of basic responsibilities. First, it must accept a message from the sending application and send an acknowledgement that the message has been received. Next, it must place the message at the end of the queue that was specified by the sender. A sender may send many messages to a queue before any receivers remove them. Hence, the mom must be prepared to hold messages in a queue for an extended period of time. Messages are delivered to receivers in a first-in, first-out FIFO manner. Namely, the order they arrive at the queue. When a receiver requests a message, the message at the head of the queue is delivered to the receiver, and upon successful receipt, the message is deleted from the queue. The asynchronous, decoupled nature of messaging technology makes it an extremely useful tool for solving many common application design problems. These include scenarios in which elder sender doesn't need a reply to a message. It just wants to send a message to another application and continue on with its own work. This is known as send and forget messaging. Elder sender doesn't need an immediate reply to a request message. The receiver may take perhaps several minutes to process a request and the sender can be doing useful work in the meantime rather than just waiting. Elder receiver or the network connection between the sender and receiver may not operate continuously. The sender relies on the mom to deliver the message when a connection is next established. The mom layer must be capable of storing messages for later delivery, and possibly recovering unsent messages after system failures.